one thing that doesn't change is Windows updates. And they carry on regardless of what anything else is happening in the world. I oh, know, and they also do so many of them. Yeah. Well, we've just had breakfast. <laughs> And this is what happens when you don't have a thermal screen on the outside of your motor. Loads of condensation. Which we hardly ever get any, we, do we? No, we never get any. We've got a tailor-made screen on our own van. And I think if this was my van, I'd definitely get a tailor-made screen for it. It's dripping off the, uh, the windows. It's because it's so cold outside. Mm. So how did we get on last night? Okay. I yeah. mean, what's, uh, when I first got up into the bed i thought i felt a little bit because it's unusual with you know our beds mm. low down isn't mm. it mm. um so to begin with we were sort of thought we hadn't got any lights didn't we, we yeah well we thought not we oh yeah that any was lights. good wasn't it yeah we thought that we couldn't could switch, switch them off the, switch them off no because the lights were all on at the back i've gone to bed first the lights were all on so yeah. i said can i switch these lights off yeah and you look to the control panel press the lights on there and yeah. all the lights went out yeah i thought well this can't, that can't be right. right because you know you'd have to stand around in the dark yeah because yeah. i've gone to bed yeah so eventually we we found out they've all got individual switches well they? yeah it was let me show you which one it is i have to put my banana down I should never film and have a banana there's a switch up here and that controls these lights here, which are independent of the main switch, aren't they? If you say so, yeah. No, sorry, not independent of the main switch. If you switch the the main lights off, all the lights go off, don't they? So yeah. we thought, well, that's no use. We can't have all the lights off. That can't be right. That can't be right. So I discovered that that switch there, which is quite hidden, switches those lights off. There are switches under here to switch these lights on and the other side and whilst we're on the subject of electrics we think the provision of sockets is a bit well how can we say mean there's one USB there there's no USBs as far as I can tell in the lounge no. and there's only one 240 volt socket here which is in the kitchen so I'm having to use my extension lead things like the Tassimo and the toaster and that sort of thing which is silly really I mean if you had a socket in somewhere in the lounge yeah that'd be good wouldn't it mm. what you just found <laughs> well I just look so looking at it maybe because it's of my height I just thought oh yeah I couldn't see that that looks like another plug that's another socket so, so there's, I, there's actually two sockets in this van I'm gonna have to go around at my yeah my level. Uh, you are yeah and see if there are any uh, others at that anywhere. level. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Let's talk about the bed. Yeah, as I say, I went to bed first, didn't I? Yeah. So to begin with, I felt, oh, I'm really high up here. Mm. Um, it's felt strange because your your head is under the lockers if you if you move onto yeah. one side of the, your bed, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And that felt a bit weird. Um, we tried Poppy up in the middle, didn't we, in her bed? In her bed, yeah. And that was all right until she decided she wanted to get down. Yeah, and I think she's happier down she's here happier. on her chair. Yeah, and yeah. we've tried her, haven't we? On tried her on here, on here, yeah. on that one, the one on you're this sitting one. on, and she's happiest there again. Yeah. Yes. So, what did you think of the? Well, I put a new crease in my forehead. Yeah. <laughs> the um. When you're in here, there's not a huge amount of room there. Jenny woke me up in the middle of the night, something about Poppy, and I banged my head just there. But uh, I suppose that's something you do the first time you're yeah, in the bed. You won't, won't do probably won't do it again. What about the bathroom then? Bathroom, call it a bathroom. Um, <laughs> shower room. Shower room. Well, I think we said yesterday that uh, towel rails in an awkward position with the toilet there but we, we've took to hanging our towels up on the shower cubicle door so that seems to work the, the sink is really good i mean it's a great big sink this comes out of, at a fair rate there's water pumps really good the light switch is there 
got to be careful what you do with the toilet roll there's no particular toilet roll holder so that was getting wet and yeah but other than that it, it works it's a small it's a it's small airy, yeah. midship bathroom isn't yeah. it yeah yeah, this is just seven meter van, isn't and it? And it is. We've got to remember this is a is a uh, nearly a nearly two meters shorter than our van. Mm. I always think with I think we both think with a midships shower room and a kitchen opposite, you end up someone's here and someone inevitably wants to go in the bath. Stop calling it a bathroom shower, shower room. room. <laughs> someone wants to go in the shower room, yeah. and you know there's there's limited space. It's not bad. It's not bad. I think we'll get we'll get used, we get to, to, used it. to it. What about the storage? I'm I'm very impressed with the storage yes, on this van. Yeah, there's lots of lots of little cubby holes. Yeah. You know, I particularly like these under stair shoe locker type areas. That's yeah. for the fresh water there. There's one here, I think. There's another we haven't even used that one. But this is probably the most useful internal one. The only drawback with this one is you have to open the door. <laughs> and kneel on this kneel on the step to open it up. But it's a huge locker. Loads of space in there. So one of the best things about this van is the lounge area, really, isn't it? Yeah, I'm quite yeah. happy with, with that. Yeah. Um, that you've got the three seats there. Yeah. And TV's up there. Yeah, you were watching the TV last night from over from here. Over here, and yeah. you were sitting here. I was sitting there doing the editing, so yeah. that worked really well. So it does work very well. The lounge is is yeah. my favourite area. Yeah. yeah. Because you've got all this sort of space because it's an A class yeah. as well, haven't you? Yeah. We also didn't realise when we got the van that this table rotates. It was the other way round. Yeah. Can you show it? Can you do that? Move it. Well, so just push it. <laughs> just, no. just. It's just quite stiff. It just it goes like work, that. Poppy. Sorry, Poppy. <laughs> <laughs> God. Now we're in trouble. <laughs> yeah. See, but it was the other way round, and yeah. it, you can't use it like that. We were thinking, no. how on earth are you get in the travel seat? Yeah. <laughs> and yeah, then we so, discovered it rotates. Okay, so once we've got it rotated, I mean, it's it moves across as well, doesn't it? Yeah, so you put your foot on this pedal on there, down here, and can. you can move it about so yeah, people so can get in can there. Sit there. And the great thing yeah. is, you can actually move it about. Yeah. When you when you've got stuff on the table. Yeah. Yeah. Now I'm. I think all these type vans, yeah. whenever I've gone in them, I think I really like the lounge, the lounge area. Yeah, yeah. It's sometimes I struggle with how I'd adjust to the yeah. the bedroom bit. Yeah, I mean, the reason for the bed being so high is the garage. Shall we go yeah. have a look at the garage? Go and look at the garage, yeah. So this garage is absolutely huge I and mean, we'll never fill this garage with our stuff. All my, I've got all my camera gear in there, there's a stair, there's more stuff over there, cushion. I actually brought the aqua roll and realised I can't use it because I haven't brought my pump and this hasn't got an outside pump. But it's heated as well, you've got vents here as well so it shouldn't get cold in here, except when you leave the door open of course. Got the awning winder up there. Yeah, no, it's a really good garage. <laughs> yeah, so down at the front, the first or fourth. Go, on, Popster.
Well, that's it for today. Uh, I've had a bit of a rest day today. Uh, it was quite a long day yesterday. Mm. Bob and Aileen are here, as you probably saw. Yeah. And uh, we're going to have a little chippy supper tonight. Yeah, we're getting a delivery, aren't we? We're going to get a delivery, hopefully. hopefully yeah, yeah, so, uh, so we're going to have that in here tonight. Yeah, so we'll try out the, the table a little bit later. Might do a little clip of us all sitting at the table. <laughs> so we're just really curious how we're going to get on with it with the table. I mean, it's it's not a huge lounge, is it, in here? So no, but it's because of the way the table is. You've, yeah. you've got three seats. Yeah. The other side, two here. Yeah. So it should be all right. It's should only be four right. of us. Yeah. Yeah. So um, so that'd be interesting. Yeah. Then tomorrow we're going to take take it out for the day, aren't we? Yeah, I'm going to go to Blackness Castle. Yeah. 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 And uh, it's a name, isn't it? Brightness yes, Castle. Castle. <laughs> yeah. Um, we'll see how we get on with it as a touring van. Yeah. With a couple of people sitting here. I think you and Aileen are going to sit in I think that's what we... Yeah. Because this travel seat, you're sitting right in the corner. Cause it's a bit, of an, a bit of an angle because you've got the, yeah. the chair there, haven't yeah. you? Yeah, so, so you don't, I wouldn't want to go too far with it. No, no. It's a shame, really. I don't no. think... I mean, that bit there, that bit there, I don't see the point of it. No. No, I think we've said that before in a yeah. quite a few vans, haven't we? I mean, if you look how, look how deep the sofa is there, it's... Yeah. What's that, six inches? Small child, mm. maybe, could fit on there. Yeah, I suppose that's what they think. Maybe that's, that's it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, um, so we'll try it out tomorrow, and obviously we'll keep you updated how we get on with it. Yeah. The blinds in here are pretty good and uh, cover most of the window. The only thing I would say is because of the there's no door on that side so what you get is a bit of a silly really but you've got a gap there so the light comes in mm. in there I mean when it's really sort of dark inside you you sort of notice that probably do but I don't know what Same you... Same over that other corner. Oh I, I, not so much though no, is it? No. no. There's only a little bit of light coming in there but uh, if it had a rail or something there, then maybe maybe that'll close it off. Yeah. It's just silly things that you spot when you use a van. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, well, yeah it, it is a really nice van. Um, we are enjoying it a lot, and uh, it'd be nice to take it out on a little little trip, trip. tomorrow. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So if you like what you see, give us a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe, and we'll catch up with you on the next one. Okay. See you soon. Bye then. Bye.